electric minibuses are taking to the streets of Nigeria. They're built by entrepreneur Mustafa Gajibo. He's on a mission to promote clean energy and curb pollution by converting petrol-guzzling minibuses into electric ones, offering local passengers more comfort, a cheaper fare and a lower carbon footprint. As you can see, we always have uh, prices of fuel are going up, prices of uh, transportation are also going up, and then you can see the damages uh, normal vehicles. That's the petrol-powered vehicles, diesel-powered vehicles are causing to our environment. So I came up with this technology to solve all this problem. Gajibo has already ripped the combustion engines from 10 minibuses, replacing them with solar panels and batteries. Now he's going a step further, building an electric minibus from scratch. It will be a 12-seater battery-powered bus fitted with a home-style air conditioner. When complete, it will be able to cover up to 120 miles on one charge. Cost is a very key thing we put into consideration when designing our buses uh, and our vehicles at large. Uh, because, you know, it doesn't make sense to produce a technology that people cannot afford. So we are always trying to see how we bring down the cost of our production so as our selling cost will be also affordable for people. Like in most of Africa, the combustion engine reigns supreme in Nigeria because electric vehicles are expensive and infrastructure for charging them is poor. Gasoline is heavily subsidized by the government here, while electricity needed to charge EVs is very patchy. For now, Gajibo has one charging station powered by solar. His drivers bring in their buses to charge at the station, while maintenance work is done every two weeks.